Getting a toy for your dog is always exciting. It's always fun to see how happy they get playing with something new. But with all the tugging, chewing, and biting, those toys can get ruined pretty quickly. Luckily, with a few easy steps, you can make a durable, entertaining toy for your dog right at home. And all you need is a ping pong ball and some rope. I'd suggest getting about 11 feet of rope if you're going to use a small ball like a ping pong ball. That's what we're going to use today. Then, once you have your materials, you're going to tie a monkey's fist knot. Here's how you do it. Step one, hold the end of the rope in your non-dominant hand and wrap the rope around all four of your fingers five times. Make sure it's not too tight around your fingers. When you're done, you should have five lines of rope across your hand and a circle of rope if you look at it from the side. Step two, grab the other end of the rope and loop across the outside of the rope around your hand so it creates a cross. Loop it around three times, then pause. Step three, place your ping pong ball inside your rope so it's nested inside. Then continue to loop the rope around until you get to five lines across again. Step four, the long end of your rope will now be hanging out near an opening. Loop the end through that opening and in through the opposite opening. String it through those two openings a total of five times. Step five, find the end of the rope you started with and push it into the center of your rope ball. Be careful not to push it all the way through. It will stay nestled in the middle when you tighten up the ball. Now get ready, this is the fun part. Pull the rope so it becomes tightened from where you pushed in the ends of the rope. Continue pushing and pulling the rope slack tight through all of your loops until the ball is tight. Then you have your ball. Now all that's left is tying one more knot, but don't worry, this one's easy. Step one. Grab the long end of your rope and make a loop with it. Step two, wrap your rope around the loop four times, wrapping it downwards back towards the ball. Step three, stick the end of the rope through the part of the loop closest to the ball. Step four, pull the top loop so that the bottom loop becomes tight, securing the rope in it. Step five, and finally, cut off the long end of your rope. Then you have a toy your dog will love to chew on and chase around the yard. And since it's all rope, it's durable and sturdy, so your dog can enjoy it for a long time. All that's left to do now is have fun.